graduated with honors from UCLA, interned at Cedars, a distinguished residency at the Joseph Still Burns Center in Augusta, guest editor for the NJM. Credentials speak for you. That's encouraging. If I was looking to hire a Nobel laureate for a surgeon. <laughs> so my partner and I have been together for uh, over 20 years. We've uh, done over 6,000 surgeries. I was best man at his wedding, and uh, we have a son together. So as you can imagine, we're not looking for somebody to just come in and play doctor. It needs to be the right personality fit as well, somebody who's willing to emotionally invest in the practice as well as the partnership. Oh, well, that's definitely not me. I'm only in this business for the money and the girls. Hmm. You're not married? Don't believe in it. Kids? Not yet, but under the right circumstances. What about your dating life? Often, but only if they're nine or a ten. Ever had twins? Sisters, but not twins. Ass men or tit? Why choose? New York or Vegas? New York is Vegas for anyone with taste. Well, you have a taste, I'll give you that. So do you, Dr. Troy. This room, for instance, impeccable design. This chair, Milo Bauman. Distressed celadon velvet. That couch, the color, vintage tweed. The whole panel of this room is inspired. I should give you the number of my designer. You could kiss her ass instead. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, I know I get a little carried away. My mother was in the business. Uh, I grew up around this stuff. <laughs> you have a patient female. She's coming for a brow lift. What's her approach? How old? Early 50s. I push for an endoscopic brow lift. Provided you use a laser, you get nearly the same results. The patient tells her friends about her quick recovery, and that only means more repeat business. I don't want to do this.